My name's Shazia and I'm a type 1 diabetic. I've been diabetic for almost 19 years now. And the reason I'm in the hot seat is I'd like to talk about my experience of being a diabetic and suffering from severe clinical depression. It wasn't an easy thing, it wasn't a nice thing, but the benefit of having the healthcare professionals there was the key point for my life, for them to even recognise that I was suffering from depression. I tried to take my own life at the age of 14 um, and it was a very easy decision to make and I did it a few times after that as well but it was 18 by the time that depression was diagnosed which probably is a bit of a downfall but it was quick enough to be recognised that I was suffering very very severe symptoms of depression because I had totally stopped eating and drinking and at that age I weighed about three and a half stone. The health service were good to me. Um, I went to see my GP for the constant pain I had because I was all skin and bones. Um, I got referred to the hospital straight away so before I got home I had a message waiting that I have to go to the hospital. I was in there for two weeks, had physical tests done just in case if there was any physical reason to why I couldn't get myself to eat. Um, but I think we, everyone deep down knew that every result was going to come back negative and from there I saw a psychiatrist who said that it is depression and I was one of the most lucky ones to be sent to the Glasgow Priory Hospital at Langside for um, cognitive behavioural therapy for depression and there I was told it was severe clinical depression I was suffering from and although at the start it felt like prison to me with all the posh decoration and matching bed linen and wardrobes and stuff in my own room it did feel like prison and I couldn't wait to get out of there but the seven months that I spent in there were probably the best seven years seven months of my life as it made me out to come become a stronger person and become more me that I am today than what I was in the past.